हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ऑल ऑफ यू ऑन योर चैनल दैट इज ऑन जे फिजिक्स मिनी एक सो आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू आर डूइंग फाइन ऑल ऑफ यू आर हेल्दी सो एज यू नो दैट हैव ऑलरेडी स्टार्टेड द एडवांस सीरीज फॉर 2022 एंड इफ यू फील दैट द क्वेश्चंस दैट हैव डन फॉर द जे 2021 सीरीज इट कैन बी हेल्पफुल यू कैन गो टू दैट पर्टिकुलर प्ले लिस्ट एंड चेक आउट द वीडियोज दैट हैव डन अल ईयर एंड आई विल गिव द लिंक ऑफ that particular playlist in the i button so you can check it easily so let us move into this particular case or so this session today that i have bringing i have brought uh, a case of rigid body dynamics i mean it's not specially or uh, directly linked to the things in rigid body dynamics it is inculcating basically few concept closely together one is the constant in rigid body dynamics and those Who have already seen my JEE 2021 series? There you have seen already. I have done this question regarding constant relation, and there this question I am linking with work energy and power, and something with the general dynamics. So without wasting much time, let's proceed. So here in this, you can see in the diagram that there is a load of mass m. This mass is m there, and uh, this uh, structure is there. And it is given that. This mass is being lifted with some acceleration a because of the two forces p are acting horizontally. So that's the main uh, statement of the question, and they are asking to calculate the value of a. So I have taken the diagram, and in the diagram, you can see very easily that if they have given this to be b, if this is b, then this angle is theta means I can simply do it like this. This will become theta by two. So you can come over here. So if this is b and this is theta by two, this is theta by two. So this is x I am taking. Yeah, similarly, this, this, and this distance same. So x value is coming to be b cos theta by two. It's very simple, very very simple. And similarly, if we calculate y, y you see um, this is you can check this is b sine theta by two. This is also b sine theta by two. This one and in between. That these two values you will have, so total it is coming five b sine theta by two. Now, if we look at work energy theorem, we can write that work done by all the forces acting on the system is equal to changing kinetic energy of the system. How many forces are doing the work here? Two forces only. One is this horizontal external force, and another is force due to gravity. So, if I concentrate on calculating the work done due to the external force. So basically, two forces are acting on the system P and P. So I will write the total force acting here is two P. So work done will be two P into dx. Because if you look at this, for this particular force, there is a huge chance you can do a silly mistake. You can think the net force acting is zero, but it's not like that. If you think about this P, displacement is in the direction. So force and displacement are in same direction. So work done is positive. If you think about this force on the left hand side, this P is in that direction and Displacement also in the same direction, so this work done is also positive. So that is why it become two p dx. Now x we already got to be b cos theta by two. You can check it here. This is b cos theta by two. So if I apply that, then this calculation will become t w is equal to minus p b sin theta by two d theta. Right? Calculation part you can check on your own. I am not going into the details of the calculation. Next, you see. Uh, If I see what is the change in kinetic energy, dK is equal to d of half m into v square. So just a little bit juggling here, so it becomes m b d v, and this v d v term I am changing in this pattern. I am writing v d v d y into minus of d y. Acha, there is a purpose of writing that minus d y because y is decreasing, right? I mean, in this case, as it moves ahead, this value will decrease. So that's why I have written minus d y. So v d v d y is the acceleration. So I've kept m a minus d y. Now y is equal to five b sine theta by two, which I've already calculated. Here you can see I have written. So I'm just differentiating. So d y equal to we get five b by two cos theta by two d theta. Now d k is equal to already we got minus m a and d y we will get this value. Work done by gravity. It can be calculated as we know that work done by gravity. Is equal to negative of changing kinetic energy, a potential energy, because gravity is a conservative force, and we know work done by the conservative forces is equal to negative of change in potential energy. So I'm just writing my d u is equal to d of this thing minus m g b into sine theta by two, because u is equal to m g y, no? U is equal to 
एम जी इंटू वाई सो डी यू विल बी इक्वल टू एम जी डी वाई सो आफ्टर सब्सिट्यूटिंग द वैल्यूज हेयर इन दिस इक्वेशन देर विल बी सम कैलकुलेशन एंड फाइनल आंसर विल बी ए इक्वल टू टू पी बाई फाइव एम टेन थीटा बाई टू माइनस जी सो इट्स रियली अ वेरी गुड क्वेश्चन वेरी नाइस क्वेश्चन एक्जैक्टली ऑफ जी एडवांस स्टैंडर्ड वेर आई हैव जस्ट मॉड्यूलेटेड अ टिपिकल कंस्टेंट इन डिजिट बॉडी क्वेश्चन टू अ जनरल क्वेश्चन वेर वी आर रिवाइजिंग मेनी कंसेप्ट लाइक कंसेंट इन डिजिट बॉडीज वर्क एन आर्जी थियोरम एंड एंड द थिंग इन जनरल डिनामिक्स ऑल्सो सो आई होप दैट इट विल कम हैंडी फॉर यू इफ यू लाइक इट देन प्लीज हिट द लाइक बटन डू शेयर सब्सक्राइब एंड एज यूजल प्लीज हेल्प मी आउट सो दैट आई कैन रीच आउट टू थाउजेंड सब्सक्राइबर इनिशियली थैंक यू वेरी मच सी यू सुन फॉर द नेक्स्ट वीडियो